and you can apply direct observation in a variety of contexts by assessing a learner's clinical skills, by distinguishing specific parts of an encounter, such as the opening, the elicitation or presenting of a problem, background history, physical exam, explanation of treatment, closure, and so on. You can observe learner interactions with preceptors or clinical staff. You can look at specific behaviors, such as putting patients at ease, communicating clearly, listening attentively, responding to patient issues, organizing the flow of information, or practicing specific techniques. All of these benefit from direct observation.